So, we finna discuss Britney Renner. Now, I don't know if everybody familiar with Britney Renner, but Britney Renner is a IG model. She is famous for being an Instagram model. She got her fame from Instagram. She a she a trainer too, I believe. I believe she like a, a you know get your body right type of tra- a trainer. But um, I want to discuss the fact to me, and I'm saying to me because everybody don't see what I see, know what I know. Do y'all remember back in the day? It was a celebrity. If Instagram was back around back then, she would have probably been an Instagram model herself. Her name was. Korean Steffis, but they call her Superhead. Y'all don't think Britney Renner give off Superhead type of vibes? Like Korean Steffis? <coughs> I don't know. Maybe it's just me. A lot of things that she do, a lot of, like, the way she talk, her mannerisms, it just give off, like, Korean Steffis vibes all the way around. You know what I'm saying? And for the most part, they both, like, kind of talk about how they, you know, they want to be loved. They want to be desired. They want to be, you know, respected as women. And, you know, they they cl- both claim to be very passionate lovers. And they they both claim to just, you know, seem, they, they talk as if they like the woman of all women. Like, they just, you know, like, they the shit, basically. You feel me? And I think I was talking about earlier on one of my other videos. Like, that's how pretty bitches get cheated on. Because they just full of their goddamn self. But I just I just noticed a lot of similarities about the two of them. You know what I'm saying? Personally. I, for one, would love to sit down and have a conversation with both of them, honestly. Korean Steffens is not as much as of uh damn I missed my turn she's not so much as she not as much as of a entertainer and celebrity as she once was she is a writer now she writes books she has a few a few top sellers a few best sellers uh I don't know none of them honestly I haven't read none of her books I really want to read the one that nobody wants to read because it, you know, exposes all like celebrities like P. Diddy's, like the Jay Z's. You know, it, it really talks about those guys. I don't think it uses names, but it's very detailed to a point where you could kind of tell who she's talking about, possibly. I don't know. I haven't read the book, like I said. Um, Brittany Run, on the other hand, I have read her book. It's very good, honestly. It's very interesting. I don't think she gave people, you know, identity up. She didn't use real names. Some people that she talked about, you know, of course, you can assume it was this person. You can assume it was that person. But you really, you really truly don't know who the fuck people be talking about. You just can, you know, have somewhat of your own, like, little ideal about it. But as far as just knowing, you don't really know. You know what I'm saying? Uh, but yeah, for the most part, she definitely, uh, give me those vibes. Like, she's very similar to Korean Stephens. Like, very dissimilar. Like I said, uh, Korean had a huge, huge, huge infatuation and love for Lil Wayne. I don't know if she still got it. You know what I'm saying? But that was her. Now, when it come down to Britney, like, who is her, like you know, love, love of her life type of deal, like, who, who is the guy that got her head over heels, like, uh, like, Wayne had Karen Stephens, I do not know that, I can't tell you that, but what I can tell you is, the way she speaks on, like, just being in relationships and being in love, she is very passionate about being in love, I'm pretty sure she wants to get married one day, I think she already done been married, but, you know, she would love to have a stable marriage or a long-lasting marriage one day. Now, will she get that? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? I ain't here to tell people what they go get. But, yeah, that's just what I've learned about her. You feel me? So, yeah. She got to be in poly, into poly if she want to be with me.